Today's lesson is going to show you how to use JavaScript in Dreamweaver. Um, fortunately, Dreamweaver writes JavaScript for you. And in our multimedia course, we're not actually going to be learning JavaScript. We're going to be learning how to use JavaScript within Dreamweaver. So what is JavaScript on a web page? Well, for instance, um, when I click my link on my website for my blog, notice how a page pops up. So you don't have to actually lose the page that you're on. It's a pop-up page. So how do you create one of those pop-up buttons? That's what I'm going to show you in Dreamweaver. So the first thing you do is go to Dreamweaver, create a new HTML page. I'm going to go to the design view and I'm just going to create something. I'm going to type in a word called pop-up link. I'm simply going to I will select my link, and what I like to do is I like to any, enter a dummy link default variable in here. So what I do is I enter in the pound sign, and then I'm going to see that I have now created a link. I'm going to select my link, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into the Window tab, and I'm going to click Behaviors. When I do that, you're going to notice on the right-hand side of the screen, something called behaviors. These behaviors are JavaScript functions. When I click the plus sign, I'm going to notice that I can do many different things. Um, for instance, I can check to see if there's a plugin. So if I wanted to check a plugin, I could click this link and I could actually check if there is a Flash plugin. Um, basically, when somebody comes to my website, is there a Flash? Do they have the Flash plugin on their computer? If not, if found, go to this page where the Flash will play. Otherwise, go to this page where it won't, uh, which would be a regular HTML page. These are all JavaScript functions. Um, there are only a few of them here, and you can actually get a lot of them f for free from Adobe by clicking Get More Behaviors. Today, I'm going to show you how to create the Open Browser Window. So I'm going to click Open Browser Window. A page is going to pop up. URL to display. You can type in anything, whatever your new link is going to be. So. If I was on raypastor.com and I wanted raypastor.com backslash new.html, this is what would pop up. I can then set how big I want it to be. So we talked about this in class, uh, usually like 10, 24 by 7, 68 is the common height and width. Then I can say, do I want them to have a nav navigation bar, a menu bar? Do I want them to be able to scroll? Do I want there to be a status bar? Do I want them to be able to resize the page? I can choose what they can and cannot do with this page. I simply click OK, and voila, I've done it. If we go in and take a look at the code, we now see in our heading tag, we have something called a script. This is a JavaScript. Basically what it's doing is it's opening a window. And then if we look into our body tag, look at our uh, link now. We have an on click, open browser window, new, and it tells, gives specific options about what it's going to do. And that's how you use JavaScript within Dreamweaver, guys. Very simple to do, um, you know, very nice feature. You don't even have to know JavaScript whatsoever. Um, Dreamweaver does it all for you. So this is how you do it.